Hello Cancer, welcome to the Lynx Tarot. My name is Monica and this reading is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is your money and career reading for mid-June 2022 through mid-July 2022 or the next 30 days. All my readings are timeless, so they're intended for whenever you're watching. We're jumping right in with the Energy Oracle cards, then we'll go into some tarot and I will end with the Money and Career Oracle deck. All right, Cancer, you have the thinking man, number 46. If you like numerology, look up 46 and 10, because six and four break down to 10. So you've been thinking about something, maybe you're about to put your plans into action. Okay, and we have adjacent possibilities, 24 and six. There are many possibilities for you. It will soon be time to make a decision which door or window you want to go through. Awesome, Cancer. <coughs> All right, so we're jumping over to the Everyday Witch deck. What do we have for Cancer? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Check your other signs, Cancer. There could be additional messages there for you. All right, Cancer. Okay, first card out, the Five of Wands. So there could be some strife in the workplace. Maybe you're looking to leave your job, find a new job because you don't like the personality conflicts at work. Okay, so that's the first thing coming out right now. Um, this could be, I'm getting for someone listening, um, someone you're close with doesn't agree with what you're deciding to do for a living. So you have to decide, do you need to do what feels right for you? Um, or is this something really that should be a group decision? Okay, so if you're a grown adult, um, you know, typically this would be your decision. Um, maybe you're considering something that's risky in some way. Um, maybe it would be um, like risky um, physically, like um, maybe you're in construction or something like that, and your spouse or partner or, or a loved one is like, no, 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 you know, I'm too scared. I don't want you. I don't want you to do that. You know what I mean? Maybe you have like a baby on the way or something like that, and um, your spouse is, um, you know, like, no, no, that's that's dangerous. You know, we can't afford to lose you type thing. Okay, so of course that's not for everyone listening, but these are just some things popping out right now get out there to you okay so seven of wands so this is your challenges position okay this is I'm um, holding your ground um, and and or being defensive about something okay so for many listening cancer I feel like there's a really strong um, decision needing to be made about about a big issue right now having to do with work and employment Okay, we have the four of wands. So this is leading toward, you know, success and agreement because there's a celebration here. Okay, this could also be a marriage. There could be a celebration of a marriage here too. Um, there could be a celebration of a new job, people gathering together. Um, it is a strong marriage card though, reaching a milestone in a relationship. And for your outcome card, we have the star being seen. This is about success. Um, you could be purchasing some property too. Um, this is about having everything that you want, really. This could be in the form of, um, you know, financial security. This could be in the form of work success, a new job. This could also have to do with, um, you know, getting along with your partner and coming into, um, coming to a place of agreement. Coming to a place of agreement when it comes to what one of you is choosing to do for work, okay? But I'm getting for you, Cancer, you're coming to this beautiful place of peace on your own confidence like you you have reached this level of success and um and praise you're being praised you've reached this on your own and also there could be an aquarius in your life or strong aquarius in your chart okay so let's go in and clarify yeah there are many possibilities like we saw in the beginning there um, the adjacent, adjacent possibilities. So clarifying the five of wands, we have the nine of pentacles. Okay, very nice. So this is becoming independently wealthy or you're headed that to that place right now, um, being able to enjoy the fruits of your labor. Um, clarifying the five of wands, 
This could be someone's jealous of you. So if someone's acting jealous of you, get away from them, okay? Because they just wanna bring you down, they want what you have. Um, jealousy is just very, very negative. Um, you know, I, in my, my opinion, in my personal opinion, jealousy is the root of all evil because it creates such ugliness and destruction, okay? And it's usually the kind-hearted people who are, um, they're the ones that are victim to it, okay? So be really careful about that. and. Be in your enjoyment here. Be in your success. Be in that energy. Pull away from anyone who is acting like, you know, what you have should be theirs when they haven't even worked for it. Okay, so let's clarify the rest of these cards here. Hang on a minute. Too many. So we're clarifying the Seven of Wands, the Four of Wands, and the Star. Okay, so clarifying the Seven of Wands, we have the Two of Pentacles. So you could be juggling ideas, you and your partner. Or it could even be a business partner. You could be juggling two different ideas. You're both being really, really stubborn, but you're going to come to a place of agreement, okay? Whether this is, you know, a family member or someone that you work with, okay? And um, if there are those who are, like I said, being jealous and causing trouble for you, um, I'm getting, you know, it's time to make a decision, okay? Do you want to live in peace? Or do you want to have this like fly in the ointment, you know, ruining all of your, your success and your glory? Okay, so let's clarify the four of wands. Okay, and the star. <coughs> Excuse me. Clarifying the four of wands, we have the ten of swords. So you're at the end of difficulty here. So sorry, allergy season is still here. You're at the end of this difficult cycle. Okay? It's not going to be hard anymore if you don't let it. Okay? Just get rid of whatever's negative in your life and move forward. Because this happiness and celebration is waiting for you. Okay? And you deserve this. Sorry about that. Just needed some more water. All right. And clarifying the star... We have the Page of Wands, a passionate new beginning, see? You're being recognized, praised, acknowledged, okay? You're, you're earning money, okay? You're uh, earning money and you're able to put your money somewhere, okay? Maybe you're moving out of a, an apartment and you're finally buying a house. You're investing. Some of you are getting a new car. You don't have to deal with that car that kept needing repair after repair, okay? You know, putting all your hard-earned money, hard money into this car um, because you couldn't afford a new one, it was kind of like a um, vicious cycle, right? But then all of a sudden, you are leveling up, you're making more money, maybe you have a new job, or maybe if you have your own business, it's um, hitting that point of success and money is flowing in, and you can get rid of that car, right? And get a new one that's not going to cost you in repairs every month or every so often. Okay, love it. All right, so let's go over here to the guardian angel messages and get some more clarifiers. All right, what else do we have for Cancer? All right, Cancer. Clarifying the Five of Wands and the Nine of Pentacles, we have the Four of Fire, right? We've got the Four of Wands twice. Prosperity, contentment, and celebration. Check that out. Prosperity, contentment, and celebration. This is coming out twice. This energy is a very strong here. Okay? Getting somebody listening, you're going to need to disclude that petty person. Okay? You're going to need to disclude that person. Okay? We have a major arcana here, the emperor. So there could be a strong Aries in your life, strong Aries in your chart. Um... This is clarifying the Seven of Wands and the Two of Pentacles. So this is organization, leadership, and structure. So this big decision that you're coming to that involves someone else, you're going to be leading this because it has to do with you. Um, if you decide that this other person has a say at all, you're still going to be the leader and you're going to come to a place of agreement. Okay, it's going to work out. It's just important to put forth the effort. It's important that you both communicate. Okay. This is about figuring it out with a thinking man. It could be man or woman, doesn't matter. And adjacent possibility. So it's working out all of these possibilities. 
okay, and figuring out what is best for your life, your lifestyle, if this affects loved ones, um, considering that as well. Okay, clarifying the Four of Wands and the Ten of Swords in this row, we have the Queen of Water or the Queen of Cups. Very nice. Loving, giving, and psychic. So you could be coming across across somebody who has these qualities. Okay, loving, giving, and psychic. Somebody is um, coming on the scene here for your celebration and saying, I know you've been through a hard time. I've known you a long time. I'm here for you. I want to celebrate for you. I know you. I know you deserve this. I'm happy for you, okay? So for someone listening, this is going to be a very loving, comforting energy. It's going to make you feel good. It's going to make you feel validated, okay? And in the next row, we have the star, which has to do with valid, which also has to do with validation. So clarifying the star and the page of wands, cancer, my God, look at this. We have the 10 of earth, prosperity, security, tradition, okay? This is amazing. So this could have to do with inheritance, trust fund, unexpected money, um, family getting along family security your pets for those animal lovers you have security um, for your pets as well it just extends on and on and on awesome messages here let's go over to the money and career oracle deck and see what else we have for you cancer what else for cancer Cancer, if you haven't yet subscribed, please do. It would greatly help my channel. And also please hit the like button too. That helps the algorithm. It helps get all of my readings out to people who may be needing to see them. Just exposes them to those who might be searching or something like that. And hit all notifications too. So when you hit that subscribe button, hit all notifications. That way you won't miss anything. All right, so let's get a couple here from this deck. What else for Cancer? Money manager, nice. This card could indicate your career or finances could take a giant leap forward. Exciting. Consider careers in money management, banking, accounting, or anything in finance. And the other message is you can expect a happy outcome when it comes to your finances. Awesome cancer. This big decision is going to be worth the debate. We have animals. See, I was just talking about animals. So maybe some of you work with animals. I love it. Okay, you're being asked to follow your instincts at this time when making business decisions. Yes, that came out of here, came out in this reading earlier. Any career working with animals, rescue associations, or the veterinary field could be good, good for you. Connect with your power animal to improve your finances. So even if you don't have a power animal, um, you could look into that, right? If, if you don't know, you know what your power animal is, there's a cute little pig on here. You could look up the meaning of the pig and see what comes out for you or what resonates with you, I should say. Okay, one more from here for Cancer. Investment, very nice. Finances are looking good and growing. This is a great time to invest. Set a strong foundation and you will see the fruits of your labor. Very nice, Cancer. Lots of good things coming in for you. I'm getting someone's like also starting a family. It's like I'm picturing like a new family with like a new baby and also like a puppy and a kitten. You know what I mean? Like just starting out. I'm getting that for somebody. For others of you, um, I'm also getting like um, you're more established or um, yet another message. Some of you are um, a little bit later in life and you're kind of starting over and you are re reaching that established position that you've been wanting to get back like something that like a place that you were in at one time in your life and something changed and um you kind of i, I don't want to say lost but um you i have to say it that way i guess you know you you no longer have you lost that position and you had to rebuild and um you know I, it doesn't really matter what age you are but it's like kind of like that feeling like you feel like you should be established by now and you once were but now you're getting to that point again and you're like oh i never thought that i would reach this point again i never thought i would have the security and you're reaching that you're almost there okay um establish security like owning land if that's what you wish um that dream job um you know having security for everyone in your life that matters to you okay thank you so much for being here cancer great things coming your way please like share and subscribe and i will see you again soon